Chapter 2, Treehouse Comics Incorporated, or Inc., or whatever. After a hard day of cracking jokes, pulling pranks, and causing mayhem at school, George and Harold like to rush to the back to the old tree house in George's backyard. Inside the tree house, there were two big old fluffy chairs, a table, a, a, a cupboard crammed of, with, with junk food, and, and a padlocked crate filled with pencils, pens, and stacks and stacks of paper. Oh, whoops. There we go. Oh, what? Okay. okay, let's see. Uh, now, Harold loved, loved to draw, and George loved to make up stories. And together, the two boys spent hours and hours writing and drawing their very own comic books. Over the years, they had created hundreds of their own comic books starring a dozen of their own superheroes. First, there was Dog Man. Then came Timmy the Talking Toilet. I wonder if Dave Pilkey will make Timmy and the Talking Toilet. <laughs> and who could forget the amazing Cowley? I wonder if Dave Pilkey make, is going to make this book, too. The amazing Cowley. <laughs> But the all-time greatest superhero that they, they ever made up had to be the amazing Captain Underpants. George came up with the idea. Most superheroes look like they're flying around in their underwear, he said. Well, this guy actually is flying around in his underwear. The two boys laughed and laughed. Yeah, said Harold. He can fly with Wedgie Power. George and Harold spent an entire afternoon writing and drawing the adventures of Captain Underpants. He was the coolest superhero ever. Uh oh. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Look, we were boys. The secretary at Jerome Horowitz Elementary School was much to keep bus was much too busy to keep an eye on the copying machine. So whenever they got a chance, they a chance Harold and George would sneak into the office and run out sep and run out and run off several hundred copies of their latest Captain Underpants adventure. After school, they sold their homemade comics on the playground for 50 cents each. <laughs>